Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's another miserable wet day. Today I'm in Gloucester, as you can see. That's how it's set up. Clean the roof. Tower is set up. We're going to scrape the roof and then we're going to clean it. So it should come up. See how them red tiles are there? Just there. It should come up like them all over. There's a little bit of moss up in that corner section there. Uh, the rest of the roof actually isn't too bad. This side isn't too bad. The back's worse. But uh, yeah, tower's set up, as you can see. It's quite a bit of moss there, so that's why I'm tackling that section first. Let's get up there and start scraping. So as you can see, quite a bit of moss. Yeah, so I'm going to get that removed. is isn't too much on the side. We'll clear this valley out. It's just here. Uh, scrape across the top of them ridge tiles. But this seems to be the worst section here, so <coughs> we're going to tackle this section first. Uh, I am up on the tower, nice and safe. Going with the GVS Pro 30 pole, so let's, uh, let's crack on and uh, let's crack on and get this done then, because it's raining again. getting tall for this I think I'm running out of puff but from kind of that section all that section's done <coughs> well scraped anyway look at that so that section there to scrape now um, winds picking but it's nice working off the tower it's a lot safer than working off ladders but uh, I've got the GVS Pro 30 out today just about reaching to the top to be honest I probably would have been better to have used the over 8 just for that extra because I've got the 40 foot over 8 just for that little bit extra but uh, I've managed to do it this is the most difficult part because the conservatory so it's a bit of a stretch but once we get past the conservatory that last section there which is a smaller section of roof as you can see drops down look as you can see from, from that, that section there that drops down anyway so it's a bit less roof and I'll be closer to it so I'm going to get this bit scraped now I hope the footage is coming out alright it might be a bit dark because it's gone really overcast here the wind's picked up a little bit but like I said I'm safe on the tower I've got the outriggers out at the bottom as well um, yeah but uh, I'm on with the Marshall Pro double scraper and I've got the Marshall brush on the one end and a flat big blade on top um, big blades from rotten pumps so yeah it's pretty good but uh, I know I mentioned them a lot but GVS this this Pro 30 pole makes such light work of it it's only if memory serves me right 1.8 kilograms and even fully extended it's so controllable so rigid uh, it really is a good pole Look, I use it for everything um, yeah so anyway Crack on.
And there we have it, all scraped. Looks uh, much better than it. All that is off now, so we will be back tomorrow to um, when empty the gutters. We're obviously gonna. I'd already told them I was gonna. There was a lot of that on there anyway. I have made a bit more of a mess. I will admit. Hold my hands up. But I did say to them that I would. Um, that I would clean the conservatory roof off for them so it's the whole roof scraped um, I'm gonna get down off the tower and we'll have a walk around and I'll show you the whole roof that I've scraped today so that's the whole roof done uh, as you can see I've been working off the tower today nice and safely Let's just come around this side and just show you just get on this wall yeah that's uh, all that roof's been scraped and then if we walk around to the front of the house I tell you it's um, been hard work but if we go around to the front of the house it's all that front done as well Oh, that's been scraped.